Hey guys and welcome to this satisfying cleaning motivation filled vlog. In this vlog I'm going to be showing a lot of activities I did over the weekend to reset the house, get what I need to done, and just tackle a lot on my to-do list. I'm going to be cleaning my kitchen. I had cooked a lot the night before. I made a beef stew crock pot recipe as well as other things and it was just a mess. I ended up just going to sleep that night and the next morning I had to clean everything. So I'm just starting off by putting a load of laundry in. I'm also going to be taking out the trash and then we will move on to cleaning the dishes and loading up the dishwasher. I hope you guys find this video satisfying, relaxing, motivating, and positive. I hope everyone is doing well. I'm really glad to be posting this video for you all. I have been super busy this past week. I had exams from the end of a clinical rotation and I was also sick. So I have just been laying low and studying the good news is I did do well on the exam so now I have some time to catch up on editing videos for you all and then I will be starting my next clinical rotation soon. So let's just go ahead and get this relaxing music started while I clean and get things done on this productive morning. Now that the sink is cleared out and the dishwasher is loaded up, it is time to deep clean the sink. I'm just using this soft scrub cleaner as well as a scrubber from Dollar Tree just to really scrub the surfaces of the sink and get rid of anything that's stuck on. This soft scrub is an abrasive scrub, so it really helps to leave the sink shining and glistening clean. Next, I'm just using that same soft scrub and sponge to scrub down the stove top. This is going to get rid of anything stuck on and just reveal a shining, glistening, brand new looking stove top. This is super satisfying and one of my favorite parts of cleaning the kitchen, so I hope you guys enjoy.
This is the crock pot stew that I made the night before. It turned out really good. It was so satisfying on this cold winter day. We are still having cold temperatures where I live. Off camera, I did a lot of meal prepping. I made some protein pasta, some corn with bell pepper, zucchini and squash, and some other vegetables and meat. So we were just good to go for the week. We had everything in containers and organizing my food this way just allows me to continue a healthy eating habit throughout the week. Next, I'm just going to be doing some planning in my agenda. I had a lot going on on this particular week. I filmed these videos a few weeks ago, so this was before I had my exams and I just wanted to make sure I was on track with my study plans and preparing for my next rotation, as well as organizing my work schedule. After I did some planning in my agenda and made sure I was keeping track of all of my due dates, I went ahead and took some notes. I like to take notes on all of the diseases that I'm learning about, just making sure that I know the presentation of the disease, the diagnostics and treatment, as this is what I will be tested on at my end of the rotation. I just write down the important concepts and highlight the things that I need to know and the time goes by so quick when I do this and it really keeps me engaged. After I studied for a few hours, I wanted to hit the gym, so I'm just at Planet Fitness, of course, and you guys already know that I start my workouts with cardio. I like to run on the treadmill and do Stairmaster for about 15 minutes each. That way I can do a 30-minute cardio workout, which is going to help pump my blood and prevent cardiovascular disease. This just really releases endorphins, improves my mood, and there's just so many benefits to getting your blood pumping like this. It also exercises your respiratory system because you are breathing more intensely to get that oxygen in. And I've been really trying to get into a habit of doing this every day. When I was sick, unfortunately, I missed a few days of the gym, so I am definitely in need for a workout, but I will start back up and continue working out as I love to do. I'm also going to be showing some abs that I did. I just did these leg lifts and some Russian twists with the medicine ball. Later that evening, I was just relaxing at home. This is the dog that is at the home. We call her Puppers. She is very affectionate and sweet, and she just loves to roll on her back and be pet. We were just cozy in pajamas on this night, just relaxing from a long week and a long day of doing productive activities. Here I am just cozied up on the couch with some apples and peanut butter, and I'm just in this comfy blanket. Like I mentioned earlier, I did a lot of meal prep on this day, so I needed to clean the kitchen again. Whenever I clean the kitchen, it really only lasts for a few hours until I need to use it again and it just gets messy again. It's just an endless cycle. But here I am just unloading the dishwasher from earlier and then I will be washing some dishes as well.
The last thing I did on this productive weekend is wash my car. This desperately needed to be washed, so I just used this microfiber sponge here as well as some regular car wash, and I just made sure to thoroughly scrub down my car, getting all of the surfaces clean. It was covered with dust and dirt and debris, and this was so satisfying to finally get the outside of my car washed. I'm also going to be using these car wipes to wipe down my dashboard and all of the surfaces just to refresh the inside of my car. The next step is going to be to vacuum it, but I will do that at a later date. This is going to sanitize my car and just leave it clean for me to start the week with. So this brings us to the end of this productive vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed all of these satisfying cleaning motivation related videos. I hope everyone is doing well and conquering their goals. I can't believe January is already over, so I hope everyone had a wonderful first month to 2024. I have some more cleaning motivation, recipes, and productive vlogs in the works, so get ready for some more content coming up now that I have some more free time. I'm also going to be starting my new rotations soon. So thank you guys so much and I will see you soon in the next video. Oh,